Anton Scoro, BJPin.com. I've got the hitman here. How is it having to rematch opponents? Because the one thing that I would think is, it's, uh, I mean, you've already game planned for him, but now you have to game plan a little bit different because you guys both have evolved since you guys have fought. Yeah, I mean, everybody everybody changes, everybody gets better. I've gotten a lot better since the first time we fought, and I'm sure Carlos gotten a lot better too. But, uh, you know, the first fight, it was a tough fight. It was back and forth action. It was close fight. I got the win. Now I got two more rounds. Give me a five-round main event, so two more rounds to finish it. So this time I'm going to go in, I'm going to finish the fight. Well, and you've, uh, you've been a fan favorite for a while because you always go in and put on exciting fights. A fight like this screams action-packed, you know? I mean, it really is a treat for the fans. Uh, how excited do you get when you find an opportunity to face an opponent like this that you know you're going to go in there and have the potential to win a bonus? I'm happy to fight Carlos, you know? He comes in to scrap, he comes to fight, and that's where I go. We're both, we're both going to be going for the finish, and it's not going to go to the end. It's not no decision. You know, I'm tired of going to the judges. I'm, I'm there to finish it. I'm sure Carlos is too. It's going to make a great fight. But, of course, in the end, I'm the one that's going to be raising my hands up. All right, man. Well, and uh, you, uh, you've, you've been out here in Vegas for a while. And uh, obviously, we're out here at the UFC Fan Expo. I'm, I'm kind of curious to get your thoughts about being a part of this because, I mean, it just continues to get bigger each and every year. We see more and more fans, and uh, we see more opportunities for fans to be a part of the expo other than just walking around. So how is, uh, how is this for you being out here and being a part of this this weekend? I'm just trying to have fun, you know, and you know, meet some fans, and they come up. Take some, I'm just trying to enjoy it, you know, have some fun, you know, and uh, mostly everybody that come up are cool, and uh, it's, just a, it's just a big spectacle, you know. Like you said, it's getting bigger and bigger, and, uh, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm being pretty busy, you know, you got you guys chasing me down for this and then I got UFC pulling on me and, you know, but it, it's cool. I still got my training in this morning and, uh, you know, trying to enjoy it and have fun. Well, and I was going to ask, how big of a distraction is it for you guys that are currently in camp and, and getting ready for fights to have to be out here? Because, you know, we talked to a few fighters and they said, hey, I'd rather be at home training, eating, doing what I need to do, but I'm out here, you know, all day. So is it a big distraction for you during fight camp to have to do all this stuff? It could be worse, you know. The good thing is I, I live in Vegas, so so I can go home in my own bed, you know, and sleep. But uh, I still got training in this morning and uh, got here afterwards. You know, I'm, I'm not, I won't be able to get a training pass in later today, but, uh, you know, it's all right. I, I still get some work in. And, uh, of course, it's a distraction, but I work around it. I still get some work in. All right, man, 170-pound division. Uh, you know, obviously, George St. Pierre has been at the top for quite some time. Uh, I'm just kind of curious. Do you think that the tide's about to change and we're going to start seeing some new guys go ahead and try to grasp for that belt and uh see george walk away here soon i will see you know i'd love to fight george that's the guy i want to fight the most out of everybody not just because he's got the belt but because of course he's regarded the best best there is and uh you know i i want to fight him i want to all right man so 2013 we're halfway through the year before i let you go i've got to know what's the uh what's the ultimate goal for you heading into 2013 uh to finish out the year well, I want to win all my fights. That's the goal, you know. I, I had a little setback, and uh, I got to I got to come back and uh, prove I'm still in the top of the division. And and I want to I want to not only fight for the title, I want to win that title. That's my goal. But right now, my goal is to win all my fights. All right, brother. So before we let you go, uh, tell people where they can follow you on Twitter and uh, shout out any sponsors or anything you got, my man. Follow me on Twitter at Martin Camman and uh, check out martincamman.com. And uh, thanks to all the fans for the support. Thanks to you guys for doing the interview. Check it out, guys. Anton Scoro, BJPin.com, the hitman. We're out. <laughs>